raped his ex-girlfriend. All right, we don't usually take notice when a house goes up for sale. Not a big deal, right? But we do when it used to belong to Missouri's most notorious politician. This gorgeous mansion in Ward Parkway was built for none other than Tom Pendergast in 1927 by J.C. Nichols famed architect Edward Tanner. It comes complete with a gorgeous indoor pool. Should be coming up here in just a second in these pictures. This could all be yours for just under $4 million. Bargain. All right, if you don't know much more than Tom, Boss Tom, then the Boulevard Drew named after him. He ruled Kansas City and Missouri politics in the 1920s and 30s with big time corruption. He's accused of controlling candidates and fixing elections. His reach even extended to the nation's capital, helping Harry Truman get elected to the U.S. Senate. The State Historical Society of Missouri says Pendergast eventually got caught for not paying a half million dollars in taxes and got sent to jail, causing the Pendergast machine. To finally collapse. So, if that all sounds like ancient history to you, just take a look at the Kansas City Police Department. Facing heavy influence in the department from the Pendergast machine, the city lost control of the department to the state in 1939. A governor appointed board of commissioners still runs the department. We're now the only major city in the country like this after St. Louis took back control of their department last year. KCPD Chief Forte has come out in favor of our current system, arguing it removes the department from political influence. Big news.